Hi everyone. Today I want to talk to you about the nastiest, unfortunately most accepted, four-letter word in everyday conversation. You've probably heard it once or twice and I bet you used it even today. Fine. That's right, fine. F-I-N-E. The last time you were asked, so how are you doing? Did you really give an authentic answer or did you say fine? Fine, you may as well four letter word somebody. It means nothing anymore and it is the greatest shroud that we're hiding behind and not allowing ourselves to reveal, to risk, to be authentic. I just attended my second funeral in the last two months. The second one was a client and a friend and I am so sick and tired of people so desperately seeking relationship and love and authenticity and then going out in the world and being fine. I think the reason many of us never share the truth is because we have this massive story about how judged we will be if we do. I have news for you. For the most part, that is a huge lie. The more people I talk to that say that when they reached out and when they allowed people in, what they thought the reaction they were going to get was not even close to what they got. They got understanding and compassion and empathy and support. Another way we create our own isolation is by making up this story that our primary needs are met by someone or something outside of us. And that's also not true. We are setting ourselves up for failure. They come from you granting those things to yourself believing those things about yourself. Love yourself. Are you feeling insecure, numb, and empty? Like the majority of people out there? Or are you feeling fabulous, intelligent, nice, and exceptional? Great! But why not just use the words? Why are we so stuck in fun? I just hit the seven year mark in my business and I gotta tell you, the last year or so have been really tough. I've not been fine. I have been transitioning a business to a different province. I've been working my guts out. I've been working some long hours. I have been feeling very insecure and emotional. Kind of like the fly on the wall, you know? The fly that gets to the window and it says, I can see outside and it's delicious. I'm gonna go for it. And then spends the next few hours buzzing at the window, trying everything it can, not noticing the window until it gets so tired it finally falls to the sill and eventually dies. I've been feeling like the fly. Thankfully I've been reaching out, asking for help and in areas, all areas, and I have now started to see the window, what's in my way. I've been taking some courses, looking at myself, what are my beliefs, what's going on for me. I'm telling you this because I don't want you to think that I'm fine all the time just because I do these video blogs or have a website or put out a newsletter. I'm not. I struggle just like the rest of you. I've been so exhausted some days I can't do a video. There are far too many of us that are hiding in our lives and hiding in the world and walking around so desperate for rich relationship and afraid to ask for it and not getting it because we're putting on this big image that we're all Fine. Don't let your own story about how much people are going to hate you or how ashamed you are if people really knew the truth. Please, I beg you, do not let that stop you from reaching out and creating the support network and the rich relationships that you deserve. Today's the day. Reveal. Be authentic. Start now.